right, guys, we got Turtle Queen on the camera today. She's recording me. Hi. This is her new job. So we have to spray down Oscar, and also we have a newcomer. Can you guess what it is? You don't know. Okay, so we make sure you get in me, all right? Don't, don't, make sure. I'm still in the shop. Okay. Um, you are. Okay. We're gonna change out Oscar's water really quick. Come on, in. come on, come on, so you can see. Don't be scared. She's not here. He's right there. His water is very dirty. Can you see Oscar water? Yeah. So we're gonna grab his water out. Uh, first, I have to get this water, this bucket. Am I still in the shot? Am I? Am I in it? Cool. Turtle Queen, you're doing a great job, right? Back up just a bit. Right there. Oh. Also, we got his water dirty. And we have to clean this out every day. Every day he puts water in it because, you know, he's a water boa. For those who didn't know, yes, Oscar is a boa, a species of boa. He is an anaconda, but they're known as water boas. They're in the same family as boas. They have live birth babies. They spend the majority of their time in the water. All right, Turtle Queen, we're going to take this outside. Let's go so we can rinse it out. All right, so now we done cleaned the bowl, the, his water dish. Let's put it back in here for Mr. Oscar. There you go, Mr. Oscar. Look who it is over here. She's not important in this vlog right now. We're, we're uh, getting Oscar some water. Let's go. And then after this, we're gonna mist them down, get that humidity bump, and we gotta do like one or two more of these, but then we are good to go. Thank you, Turtle Queen. So we have a new project that just came about. Um, I'm not gonna tell you guys what it is just yet, but this is my new project right here. I will be converting this into a... Stay tuned. good people uh eclipse just had a awesome shed and i think she's is she still shedding right now whoa hey 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 no biting all right what's all that movement back there she actually just went through her shed so i'm gonna take her out so that i can get this this shed whoa take a look at that nice full Nice full shit. So we're gonna drop that there, let her go wherever she's going, and then I am going to feed her. Well, let's feed Eclipse this baby chick. Let's see if we can capture this in slow mo. So, guys, we have a newcomer. I think I said this already. Her name is Sarabi. Like, oh, look at that poop right there. Hey, Sarabi. I know this.
this is, isn't one of those like real lengthy videos like I try to keep up with, but here's a COVID update. I'm gonna turn this thing around so I can explain to you guys exactly what's going on here. All right, as you see, Koba uh, has his name on his enclosure. Uh, and we added some foliage. Uh, I'm gonna take you guys in here while Koba is sleeping. Um, all right, there we go. All right, so the lights are off. Uh, I'm only keeping one light on for Cobra so it can stay nice and warm in here. I did add one more light fixture here in his enclosure. Uh, this is the one by his door. So we have a total of one, two, and I dropped that one down. I think I made a video of that. I dropped it down some and added some rock here. Oh, right now he's underneath there. I'm gonna try to shine the light down there so you guys can see him really quick. Hold on. He's in there. You guys can see him. Cobra. And then we have my guy Peanut sitting over here looking so elegant. Ribbit. <laughs> Awkward. Like I was saying, this isn't one of those lengthy videos um, that I tried to attempt to do, but I just wanted to give you guys an update on Cobra. A lot going on. I got a really redo um, some things here. Um, it's, a, it's a lot that is going on, a lot. I'm really trying to tend to these animals. Uh, it's harder than it looks. Uh, it, it can be stressful, but not a bad stressful. Um, like with COVID, I am trying to figure out how to get his temperatures and everything like all the way proper uh, with this, with him being in this new enclosure. Uh, so it's a lot of things that I have to really pay attention to. That's really it, man. Um, we'll try this again tomorrow, get some content. I mean, cause today I pretty much was just tending to Oscar and Cobra today. Uh, tomorrow, uh, depending on how they do, uh, overnight and he can digest his food because I've been having an issue with him overnight uh, like I fed him a piece of shrimp and he and I found this he ate the shrimp and then I found the shrimp uh, in the morning so that's an indicator that it is not hot enough for him and I'm going through this stuff with you guys because I'm very transparent with what I do here and my animals if I make a mistake you know, you guys are gonna, I, I don't mind sharing with you guys because we're gonna get through this mistake. I said it's just very stressful uh, when you move an animal to a new enclosure uh, because you gotta really pay attention to every little thing, every little detail, and make sure that your animal is okay. You know what I'm saying? We will be back at it tomorrow.